and welcome to this episode of Tech in Style. Today we're going to have a very special sneak peek preview at the ASUS new motherboard P8Z77V. <laughs> it's quite a mouthful that one, isn't it? It's confusing as yeah. well, I mean, with a modern number like that. But the, the thing you want to take away from it is the Z77, okay. which is because this is using uh, the Intel Z77 chipset, which is this, this little bit here. So what, okay, so I know what these things are here, yeah. but what, what's this here? So that's the Wi-Fi Go module. Yeah. Um, that, that's something quite new they've come out with. Um, plugs, plugs onto the motherboard, it's optional. It, it's essentially a wireless controller. It comes with a, a suite of software that allows you to turn it into an access point. You can also turn it into a DLNA media hub. Do you remember, do you remember when we were looking at the ASUS Transformer? I was going to say, is that like the Transformer? It, it's, it's got some of, some of the same stuff. You know when we had the media streaming going mm, from the yeah. tablet to the TV? So you could install that software and all of your media that's on your desktop um, is, is going to make its way onto your transformer if you want to get it or from your TV. Does it come with all its own software? It comes with a lot of software. Mm -hmm. um, a couple of things off the top of my head is the, uh, the fan expert. Basically, you know, you've got all your different fans plugged into the motherboard and, mm. and this intelligently kind of makes the most out of them. So you can, if you want a quiet PC, because you know how desktops Because this, are, I was going to say, this is my problem with fans, is yeah. like the noise and desktops, to be honest, is just like... They're usually uh, quite loud. So, so yeah, they've, they've tried to tackle this problem and okay. it detects all the different fans and you say, yeah, I want it quiet. And it keeps the control and the temperature and, and just slows them down. As oh, that's very them, considerate. So. So, so what are the main features on here that we should be getting excited about, the, the newest features? the new third generation Intel core processors. This does out of the box support it. They've got this new feature called um, USB BIOS flashback. Essentially, you put, you put the BIOS on a USB stick um, and you, could, you don't have to have any, anything plugged in. You don't have the processor, no the memory. And you can press a button and it'll update the, uh, the BIOS on, on, on the motherboard, which, which is great. Well, anyone, great. Anyone out there yeah. who's built a computer before and has had that problem where I, I remember years ago, I had uh, a motherboard that it was old stock. They sent me old stock. And in the time between that motherboard being released and the newest processor coming out, um, it, wasn't, it wasn't supported. So I got the latest processor and a motherboard that was two or three months old, even though it should have supported it. And there was no way I could get it to work in order to update the BIOS because you needed to have an up and running machine. It's actually a really clever solution. I'm surprised yeah. no one did it years ago. So, so not, it's not necessarily the sort of thing you get excited about, but I'm sure there are people out there that... No, I think, no, it, it does. <laughs> no, it is making me quite excited. And like, the more I learn from you, the more I get excited. It's a really fun way of learning about what's going on. I mean, if you take a desktop, the same stuff's happening inside a laptop. It's just much more condensed. Well, thanks, Bode, for that. I do feel very well informed now, and I hope you guys do too. And if you want to see any more episodes of Tech in Style, then please subscribe on YouTube or iTunes. And, of course, head over to our forum, where our lovely community will be there to greet you. And, you know, some interesting points. I'd love to know, do you build your computers? Have you built a computer? Until next time. Well, thanks very much, guys. See you later. <laughs>